welcome back to my channel so today i'm be doing my makeup only using affordable products so i'm gonna tell you guys all the prices for each product that i'm using and nothing is like under like over 20 dollars that's for sure most things are under like 14 dollars 15 dollars and let's get on with the video the first product i'm gonna be using is the elf daily dew stick and this product goes for eight dollars and i like using this for like when my skin feels a little more dry, but I don't put this all over my face. I just try to put something under my eyes and above. It kind of gives like a little dewy effect. I don't know if you guys could see that, but I try to put some with my finger. This is how it looks. They have them in like different like shades or scents i'm not sure exactly but i went for this one i think there's like a whole description about what it is for each each one but i'm just not sure i don't even remember why i picked this one but it smells really good too and it's just eight dollars and it actually really moisturizes my under eyes so next thing i'm using is the elf primer i have two elf primers i have the elf power grip primer with niacinamide and i also have the poreless putty primer both of these products go for ten dollars so that's actually a really good deal and i love that i love sometimes i just love using both of them like i will use the poreless putty primer and then i will use the power grip primer on top next product I'm going to be using is the e.l.f. Halo, Halo Glow Liquid Filter. And what shade is this? This is in shade Light Medium. I'm using shade Light Medium. And this is actually so glowy and so pretty. But I'm not going for a crazy glowy look right now. But not too much. Just for like a base, you know? And the Halo Glow goes for... um. $14, which is also a really good price. Using this real technique brush, this is not so affordable, but not so expensive. But I'm not doing pr brushes for today. Oh, maybe in another video, like a part two to this video, I'll be doing different products. I'll do brushes as well. So I'm just gonna blend that in. So if you guys can hear like everything in the background, my house is just very loud all the time. But that's okay. I'm gonna use this. Oh, I'm kidding. A mirror to help me just blend everything in. Even has a light, isn't that so cute? Next step I'm gonna be using is bronzer. And the bronzer I'm using is the She Glam Bronzer. This is how it looks. This is in shade Golden Sun. And this retails for $4.99, which is really cheap. And She Glam Makeup, Makeup Room Machine is actually so good. And I love it. I also have the um, more cold tone tan shade, cold tone shade for like contouring, but I'm just gonna use the bronzer for today. So let's start blending this out. I'm gonna start off with blending my nose out. It also blends out so easily. Like, look at that. It's crazy. Next up is blush. So for blush, I'm using the Juvia's Place blush in shade Pink Lady. Look how pink this is. This is so pretty in their packaging. It's so cute. This is like the most priciest item I have, which is $18. So this is one of the under 20, exactly under 20 items. But this product, when I tell you it's pigmented, so I'm going to be taking like a little brush and slightly. This is also a She Gun brush, so this is also really cheap and kind of dirty. Let's ignore it. I don't know what I got on me, like eyeliner or something, but this is also like five dollars and it's a little paw. So cute. But I'm gonna using like a little da. Like that's literally it. Like look at this. That's insane. I barely touched this. This will last you a while. Wow, that's crazy. And I got some here. Of course I did. How? I don't even know. Next step is highlighter. 
and I love highlighter. And the highlighter I'm using is the Wet n Wild one. This is the one, and it retails for $6.99. That is so cheap, and I've used this a lot. I don't know if you could tell, but what shade is this? This is in Precious Petals, which is amazing. I do not have a brush for that. I don't know why I did not get a brush for it, but I'm using my finger for it, because who doesn't like putting highlight with their finger on? But this highlighter, just watch. I have a little bit of a glow because highlighter, because of the halo glow, and then maybe the blush is a little glowy. But look at this. Are you ready? That is so pretty. It's not like glittery. It's like illuminating, illuminating. On the other side. <gasps> wow, so pretty. I'm obsessed. Just like to like go like that. Glow. Next up, I like to use is the setting spray did not write down how much this has cost but i know it's actually i feel like this is also like ten dollars which is really cheap there's like nothing in here you see that it has a little ball inside like it. shake it and then spray it on i love this and actually it's the still my micro fine setting mist and it actually keeps my makeup on for so long and i love it i'm obsessed so let's just spray it all on well and it smells so good next thing i'm going to be doing is my eyes so i don't always do eyeshadow and stuff but um i'm gonna do that today so the only palette i have is this wet and wild one and i know wet and wild is a really good brand i don't know if they still have this palette out or not but this is the bretman rock palette and it's so pretty and this is how it looks there's really pretty shades so it's like really pretty pretty black shimmer shade. I'm gonna try to use that to do like a smoky grayish look. I also have these liners. Also my favorite eyeliners are the um, LA Girl Shockwave liners. These are amazing and these go for $4.99. It's amazing, like actually amazing. I love it. So I have a black and brown one. So, hmm, I'm thinking if I should use black or should I use brown to make it more natural. Let's just do that. put my Hello Kitty light on. Well, let's begin. Just a little in my crease. Like, this is such a pretty color. <gasps> wow. That is so pretty. Like, that's already enough. I'm just going to blend it out a little more. Now that that's all blended out, and that's such a pretty shade, I'm obsessed. Okay. Next, I'm gonna do. Should I use a shimmer? I feel like I should use a shimmer. But first, before I put the shimmer on, I'm gonna use the um, brown eyeliner and my waterline just to make my eyes pop a little. You see the difference on me? I love it though. You love that? That is so pretty. I'm gonna blend this one out a bit more. Now I'm gonna put a little bit on the top liner. Top line liner. I don't know what it's called, but just like this. Do you guys see that? I don't know if you see it, but it makes a little bit of difference. It does make my eye a little smaller, but that's okay. My pretty big eyes, so I can make them look a little smaller. I just love that look. Now, I'm using a shimmer because why not? Let's use a shimmer from this palette. I'm gonna use a Don't Be Lion shade. This one right here. It's like a goldish color. So let's just put a very tiny bit on the outer end of it. Blend that out. These eyeshadows are such amazing quality. Like, I actually love them so much. Like, they're amazing. I know, like, this e.l.f. has a bunch of cute colored um, palettes. Like, the four-pack one. The one with four pants. Those are really cute. I used to have them. I don't know what happened to them. Maybe I threw them out. Maybe they were like really, I had them really a long time ago, but those are really good too. But I have this one wild palette. I'm not sure what other palettes I have. I might have an Essence palette that I'll show you guys next time. It's really good too. And yeah, so next, let's do my eyebrows. So for eyebrows, I like to use the NYX Professional Makeup Micro Brow Puts in shade taupe. And it comes with the pen obviously and it comes with the brush and i love that so much first let's use this brush 
to brush them out because they be looking crazy. Just like that. So pretty. This eyebrow is kind of like the funky one. They are not sisters at all. I don't even know if they're related. Oh, there. It's all filled in. She's like a dent in her. Like, it does not grow. I'm telling you, this eyebrow, both of them, just they don't take so far for them to grow. And use the brush to blend it out a bit. Like, are they even sisters? No. Are they related? I don't know. Let's see. And use my favorite brow gel by NYX also. It's, first of all, oh my god, I didn't even see the price for this. The price for the pencil is $11. Is it? Yes, this is $11. It's so good though. I literally love it. And then the gel is $7, which is also really good. Good prices here. And it's amazing. This is the NYX Control Freak Eyebrow Gel in clear. I think they have them in different shades, but I like the clear one because my eyebrows are light and weird and I just, I don't want them to be too much. I like more of a natural look for my eyebrows. And yeah, let me guys show you guys. I also don't like when it's like really sticky and like, like I feel them. I don't like to feel that I have something on my eyebrows. And this, I don't feel it. It doesn't get so crunchy. It doesn't like, it gets enough crunchy or not crunchy. How do I explain this? It gets enough like hardened. It gets hardened enough that it doesn't, you don't feel it. You know, like when you touch it, you can feel that it's there, but it's like, it's just perfect. I love this um, gel for my eyebrows. So I just like to brush up and then dip it in again for my other eyebrow. And then do the same thing. Here it is, my e.l.f. spoolie. And I use this to lay them down. Not really. Siblings? No. These are like far cousins. This one is my favorite. Obviously, my favorite eyebrow. What can we use? Always a favorite eyebrow. Next up is mascara. And I love mascara. It's my favorite. It takes me forever, but kind of figure out how to do it a little faster. I'm using these e.l.f. Also really affordable. What is this called? Eyelash curler. Why did I just forget? What's wrong with me? I'm gonna curl my eyelashes and I'll show you guys what mascara I use. For mascara, I love the telescope. What my favorites? I have them in carbon black and then the regular one. These are amazing. I think I'm using the carbon black one. These, how much do these even go for? These go for $12.99. They're amazing. I have so many of them. There's also that other new telescopic one. I have that, but I don't like it so much. This one is my favorite though. Like my absolute favorite mascara in the world. And I'm obsessed with it. I'm just gonna do just the tips. Just so it's like more natural. And doesn't weigh my lashes down. Isn't that so pretty? Love this mask. Dip it in one more time to do my other eye. That's it for my mascara. I think it looks very pretty. Now, next up is also my favorite. My favorite steps are mascara. I could show you guys one lip liner that I love as well. I have two NYX lip liners, two of them, I think. I used to have more. I don't know what happened. I just lose them all the time. But, um,. I use this, I'm going to use the nude pink lip liner. I think this is literally $5. Isn't that crazy? This is amazing. So I also have the um, lip glosses by NYX. The um, butter glosses in four shades. And I want to get more shades because these are amazing and they're $5 each. Isn't that so good? That's actually crazy. And I also have this affordable lip gloss. I think that's like ten dollars yeah it's like ten dollars and it's so pretty too it's a lip drink gloss by maybelline and it smells amazing and this is such a pretty shade but i think i'll be using one of the um next lip glosses to match with this one i love using the shade um i love creme brulee to be honest i love the shade tiramisu but i'm gonna use creme brulee and shade nude pink for the um lips so let's apply that. I'm just gonna go up closer so you guys can see better. I 
I love this lip liner. It's such a good nude paint. I'm obsessed with it. Now for the lip gloss, I'm using the uh, creme brulee shade. I'm just going to show you guys how that looks up close. It is so pretty. Now let's apply it. It really reminds me of like the 2000s lip and I am all for that. We love 2000s looks and everything. I'm just obsessed. So this is how my makeup look turned out and looks amazing for using only affordable products. Honestly, like look at this. You don't need to spend too much money on makeup to get good makeup. Like, like everything I use is just perfect and such good quality and for so cheap. And I'm obsessed. Most products I use are affordable. And we love that. Because that ain't a budget. And I love having so much makeup too. I just love hoarding makeup and just having different products. And especially when they're affordable and I can spend a lot. It's amazing. We love that. And that's it for my video. This is how the makeup turned out with only using affordable products. I think it came out pretty well. My eyes look really good. My eyebrows look amazing. My skin, lips, everything is just perfect. So thank you guys for watching my video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Mm -hmm.